Message begins right now. New chakras inside, diamond laser frequencies with accompanying words the veils are gone. The 23rd of October 2017, charging photons and how photons behave now dictate how our realities correlate as well. This increasing photonic activity moves us all into more quantum existence than ever before. Photons move us all out of linear and more into ping pong effect realities, where particle matter and light behave differently than old linear did. This increase in photonic activity, by way of cosmic disturbance and cosmic atmospheres and cosmic galactic dimensions opening up as we move into these vibrational realities more, will change our realities in ways that are even more different than before. For us who function quantum, as photonic light, as vibrational beings, this makes everything much easier, yet for the human aspect that functions linearly, this increases polarity, increases confusion, increases loss of control, increases physical body things, increases fear, survival programming, increases collapse, which is just a part of the restructuring process that occurs, yet the speed, force is relative to how linear, physical each's reality is. Speed is different and force is different, time is different, all increases, decreases differently for the quantum being and the linear being. I will explain a little bit to create the picture to start to understand how our new earth realities work. It's important to remember that everyone is on this galactic multi-dimensional earth now, just in different vibrations, dimensions and timelines. Therefore physical realities are very different too. Our now super quantum new earth, everything is vibrational energy and influx. It's the foundations of each dimension that is very different and it's important to understand that it's the foundation, structure and form of each reality that is being redone. This redoing, is a process of recoding, deconstructing, reconstructing, recalibrating, retuning, reassociating and rebirthing, rebooting, regenerating and more. It's an ever-changing reality where physical matter takes form in response to vibrational everything. This increase in photonic realities is a huge step for us all. This is because photons can't be controlled, except through the intentional focus without focusing, which the human aspect does not have the capability to do, for this is done as photonic energy, which means that we focus our consciousness focus our energy and direct the photons within our bodies, fields and all realities to create, converge, into form intentionally and vibrationally. With 360 degrees vision, we can see peripherally, quantumly and direct photons in every direction simultaneously, as our realities are vibrational from within us, so tuning our own focus, vibration changes the path direction of these quantum photonic cells, atoms, molecules. Therefore restructuring the code of each to create, shape realities according to this connection that we hold with all things is one here. Photonic light works in a non-linear vibrational fashion. Photonic cellular bodies do this as well. Photons are directed vibrationally and are free form. When charging and preparing to take off, quantum travel, they are vibrating and increasing this vibrating, vibrational movement until boom, full momentum has been achieved for the multidimensional expansion to occur. This expansion process allows for photons to act radically, which means that they are not bound to linear constructs at all. This radical behavior can only be directed through one's own quantum access, existence which is achieved through the full embodiment of light. I can't read photo credit, will update with appreciation, respect and love. The human aspect feels this biophotonic energy moving in their body, shaking, rattling, trying to move freely, yet it cannot weather is physical matter in the way. This physical matter is density and must be broken down so that the physical matter within the physical body can move freely as well. This process challenges everything that makes logical sense and is done through the activation of each's quantum light cells, 
light body, which sends electrical charges through the physical body to awaken the dormant physical matter in the body that was asleep, unconscious, and bring the physical body into full consciousness again. This means that all that was unconscious and held deep in every atom, molecule and cell must be woken up, releasing the old beliefs, mentalities, feelings suppressed and pain housed by each as well. This mental slash physical slash emotional release is necessary for the physical body to ascend and to evolve into a fully conscious vessel that houses each is soul fully, where constant and continuous integration, anchoring and merging, unification, occurs 24-7. Yet each must honor this process fully for ease to be the way this part is experienced all along the way. Photonic light is also how we travel and access multiple dimensions easier. Our consciousness can travel while we are here, in the waking state, in the sleep state, in the space in between, our capabilities to travel and exist through as light is so much easier. Walking around and interacting on a multi-dimensional level is so much easier too. Our bodies are acclimating in all new ways for functioning on new earth. With our physical bodies easier now because the atmospheric frequencies are so high all of the time. More can bilocate and access multiple dimensional realities simultaneously from this one here so much easier than before. More are remembering faster now. It's awesome. Others we are interacting with, who have been doing the work and exist from their highest places too, are experiencing more as well, which makes for awesome exchanges, lots of play and conversations for sharing, remembering together too. More of us uniting in higher service, coming together to further create, inspire, support, share. It's beyond magically exquisite. There's no more lack in our relationships. Everyone is awake and standing in their own power, when this is what we support, require and transmit out ourselves. Starlight beings uniting in the physical on the highest vibrational plane of existence. We are giddy with excitement. My new word every day is explore. Every day I get up to do my day, accomplishing, interacting, doing and exploring every nanosecond as love sharing unity love consciousness with all that i connect with and touch to my our every exchange is to inspire uplift support make a difference as love and show others what our new earth existence is like being the example means that we make a difference in every way our presence essence and magnetic energy is inspiring and creates hope in humanity. Yesterday I was out, and as my every moment usual, was in generosity mode, helping slash assisting slash acknowledging slash appreciating others in a multitude of ways, to show them what kindness and caring for each other is really like. It's so amazing at how surprised each person is when I do such kind and thoughtless things, for them no reason. They don't know how to act, to receive. Some are shocked, some present with fear, picking up those broken down on the side of the road, some don't know how to receive, when I buy their lunch slash dinner, some are so grateful, when I leave gift cards for groceries for random peeps at the registers. Yesterday, the sweet girl at the register in a restaurant was so blown out of the water, she said it made her day. Her word was that this kindness was infectious. Now that's awesome. We are infecting others with love consciousness. Just by being our purest form of US. Other times I'm teaching, re-educating to uplift, random exchanges present the opportunity for this. Remember, it doesn't matter what you do, whether you understand. All you have to do is really truly care from the depth of the core of your entire being and then everything you do and are is pure. The last few days, week, the frequencies are the highest ever and continued to increase substantially as we go. 24-7, non-stop, higher and higher and higher we go. Continuous integration and acclimation are necessary for us all. There is a definite difference in the air in our bodies. So much light, so supportive 
So ready for all new, can you feel it and are you experiencing it in your everything too? The 28th of October 2017, last night we go hammered with mega galactic diamond lasers that cut through old veils. As I was driving, all night, the words kept repeating, to get my attention in order to share, the veils are gone. This is going to mean lots, in each dimension how things are about to play out. I will be sharing, at some point, about the anchoring in our physical bodies of new geometrics and how this is affecting more. My most recent, all this year, has been the embedding of the Earth star chakra inside of my body, feet. It's been immense and lots of dedicated by work for me. In the early stages, all chakras, geometric multidimensional vortexes, beyond the first seven, were located outside of our bodies. Once we activate these incodements, the consciousness and go through the immense initiation processes and complete each gateway, we integrate, anchor them into our physical body slash form slash cellular structures, which can be intense. It's a part of our advanced new earth human plasma crystalline light bodies here. The physicalness of our physical evolution is beyond words constantly recoding slash reconfiguring slash adapting to function in higher, highest dimensional frequencies and walk multidimensionally as pure divine light beings here. Fully anchoring, integrating and holding all of this, embodiment, as our new way of being and honoring the ever-changing phases that our bodies are in, takes much presence, love, dedication, focus, honoring, kindness and care on our parts for what is often seen as the most important part of these processes here. Years ago, holding the 13th dimension of Christed consciousness, meant the integration of this fully, then God consciousness, galactic consciousness, the integration of the soul star chakra within my whole form, the new earth chakra, which I speak about in a recent interview that's posted via replay and more. Our stargate being constructed all along the way, our bodies and fields having to constantly synchronize and adapt to all new frequencies and our realities constantly shifting, tuning vibrationally too, for our outside hologram to constantly change and solidify, anchor into the physical is an ever-conscious experience. Be the difference in your reality world. Be the light in every interaction. Open up fully and allow yourself the most exquisite experience of multidimensionality now. Step into your power as love and show others what unity love consciousness, generosity, kindness, respect and new earth is. As you do, you'll reconnect with others, because this is your new vibration. I'm offline much of November doing magical retreats and more. I'm still doing gatekeeper duties first, sharing where I can. I'll post where I'm able and return in December, if I'm not traveling. We have much we are accomplishing behind the scenes. Preparing for the upcoming, as more step into their highest roles too and unite to create slash share slash offer slash support even more too. Super mega love from me to you from our beloved cow I. I'll post some rainbows and awesomeness soon in a mini photo gallery, until I can get the photo gallery pages updated for more activations there too. Lisa Transcendence Brown. End of the message. Much love to all you soul sisters brothers. Watch DNA Awakening previous videos for better understanding, new subscribers will be updated with the latest articles and informations. We hope this channel has helped you discover where to start on your actual spiritual path, it's a good karma to put to like, comment, subscribe and share with your beloved ones, leave your suggestion in the field below, all the love to you, beautiful